A young star with plenty of accolades. The youngest United States champion and the youngest Money in the Bank winner in WWE history. The following contest is a fatal five-way match. Making his way to the ring from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, Austin Theory. All the potential in the world, but unfortunately, a bad attitude too. It looks like Theory brought all of his friends in the ring with him tonight. Oh, watch your mouth, Cole. You are looking at the youngest United States champion and Mr. Money in the Bank ever. How did that cash in go? Well, that... I can't... Well, I, I don't have that information readily available. Usually the guys at 2K are great about giving me the stats. I, I, I'll get back to you. Listen to this frenzy for L.A. Knight. If any dummies out there don't know, now they know. And from Los Angeles, California, weighing in at 241 pounds, L.A. Knight. By some accounts, L.A. Knight should never have made it to WWE. Well, he is proving the doubters wrong right now. This guy has never met a spotlight he didn't like, but I'll give credit where it's due. When you're as good as L.A. Knight, you shine bright naturally. You are looking at the future of the bloodline and representing the from Las Vegas, Nevada, weighing in at 250 pounds, Solo Sikoa. A man of very few words, Solo prefers to let his fists do all the talking. You talk about intimidation factor, Solo has this entire arena feeling uneasy right now. When it comes to the street champion, Solo always puts that title on the line. It is time for the Don to make that money. And representing the D'Angelo family from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 240 pounds, Tony D'Angelo. D'Angelo, a former All-American wrestler, now taking over all of WWE. Now, that's pretty impressive given his family's background in waste management. Tony D'Angelo may be the Don, but he's not afraid to take a business into his own hands. It's because it's a family business. And tonight, Tony shows the world that business is good. It is time for the crowd to take pictures and the competition to take notes. Oh, Prince Pretty has arrived. 
And from seasonal residencies, weighing in at 212 pounds, Tyler Breeze. Look, everybody, it's Tyler, a competitor as dangerous as he is gorgeous. Yeah, Breeze has taken part in his share of classics, but now it's Breeze's turn to take the crown. If being gorgeous is a crime, lock this man up. And he knows a thing or two about the legality of looking good. Fashion police in the house. As dangerous in the ring as he is fashionable outside of it. This fatal five-way is underway and things are about to unravel here quickly. Being the odd competitor out here can be an advantage if you're smart about it. Let the other fool pair off, and then you get to play sp oh. Oh! Hoist it up. Burning hammer! Spin kick to the midsection. There he goes, right into the corner. Kick to the gut. Hooked up. DDT! What kind of headspace do you need to be successful in a no disqualification match? A ruthless one, Cole. You can't show any remorse about going after your opponent full force. Anytime you waste second guessing yourself, it's time for your opponent to get their hands on a weapon. Hard to grab or apply a proper hold after a move like that. Bringing out that kendo stick means he is truly willing to go to the extreme. Caught with a punch. He's absorbed some damage. Wait a minute, setting in. Devastating submission coming. Kendo stick impact. In the cover. Only a one count before the kick out. Easy kick out there, but they'll get hard. Hooked up. The better one, Fallon. Good night. Good grief. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. Torturous focus on the leg. Ooh! About to be the proverbial one-legged man in the you-know-what ticking contest. He can do it here. Now we see Knight. Power right out one. Frankly, he should have known that wasn't enough.
Let him up here. Up in the suplex. Oh, no. oh man. Tucks his tail between his legs and gets out of there. Kick on target. He may be in a bad way here. Looking wobbly in the corner. Oh, the chair projected right to the face. Tyler Breeze with a double under. Unprettier. Big four. Makes the cover. And he stops the count. Now Breeze. Oh, D'Angelo anticipated that. Watch out. And Tony just taunting his opponent now. Shark punch. Oh, man. Did you hear the snap of the kendo stick? And he's out of there in a nick of time. And full control here. Face first. Ooh, shot that chair right out. We've already seen a few shots delivered up in that region. Oh, this does not look good. Outside the ring, dangerous area here. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Don't do this. Punishment by any means next. Necessary. Muscling up there. Par for the Northern Light suplex. And he kicks his opponent away. Swinging neck breaker. Yeah. D'Angelo showing no fear, no intimidation. Oh, and Knight fights back. Superstar to watch with this one. You can tell this guy was fired up from the moment the bell rang. He definitely had the motivational advantage in this match. <laughs>